Three things I really liked about the Asus Prime AP201 in 21 seconds. Go! One, holes, holes, glorious holes. Wall-to-wall -wall holes, good for both performance and aesthetics, and the side panels are easy to pop on and off. Two, shorter and longer MATX case, so still compact but large enough to support bulky components. Three, front panel USB Type-C, small feature that a lot of people ask for, and it's very clearly labeled here. What's up, internet? Kagaya nung nabagit sa intro, the AP201 is full of holes, as in literally, wall-to-wall -wall holes to from the sides, the front, the rear, and the bottom. And that's a good thing for two reasons, performance and aesthetics. So performance, you do want a lot of airflow. Yung harap, dapat makahigup ng hangin, tapos yung exhaust, dapat lalabas dito sa side, sa top, and sa rear. The holes allow you to do that. Pag hawak mo dito sa side and sa top, ramdam mo yung coolness ng exhaust or yung init ng buga, depending on how hard your PC is working. And to be honest, it's a nice tactile feedback na, oh, malamig nga computer ko. You can feel the slight gust of air against your hand. Malit lang na bagay, pero wala kang ganun na experience in a usual TG side panel build. And number two, it's great for aesthetics because all of the holes allow you to diffuse the light. Sobrang clear kasi nung usual TG side panels, you can see everything, you can see all of the light. This one kind of cuts up your view because there are a lot of holes, the light gets diffused, and your view becomes sort of like an impressionist painting na your view of the inside is a little bit cut up. That's an interesting look and I do quite like the overall effect. Kita mo naman dito sa side, and then you see the backdrop of the RGB dito sa ilalim. So the holes of the AP201 work well both for performance and for how it makes the case look. Bagay na bagay sa quality, look, and premium feel niya. So this is an M80X case but it's a roomy, no compromises on performance. Lahat ng gusto mong hardware mapapasok mo dito. As you notice, it can fit a 360mm RAD AIO. We installed the Strix LC2 360 AIO. No problems, works perfectly, fits perfectly. And you can fit a 338mm GPU inside as well. Kahit yung pinaka top of the line cards ngayon, mapapasok mo dito. Just to compare to other MATX cases, this is our usual, one of our usual MATX cases from Deepcool, the MacCube 110. You'll notice the AP201 is shorter than the MacCube, but it's also longer. So yan yung parang form factor niya na mas nakakrouch siya, kumbaga, it's slightly closer to the ground. So it does make it more compact. But they have made allowances for all of the big things you might want to put in here. Kaya mas mahaba siya. And accompanying all of the holes I mentioned earlier are panels that are super easy to remove. Snap on, snap off lang sila. Top off. Front off. Side off. Appreciate the RGB. And finally, the side that people don't usually see, even that panel comes off quite easily. So wall-to-wall -wall holes and wall-to-wall -wall snap off panels. Sobrang dali lang to remove and to put back on. Yung concern lang namin dito is that perforated nga siya, mesh type yung mga panels, but you'll notice na wala silang filter. The only available dust filter in the AP201 is yung dito sa ilalim. Magnetic dust filter siya. Since it is magnetic, it does come off quite easily. Pero yun nga, this is the only filter that comes with it. Yan lang yung reservation namin na this might be better in a uh, air-conditioned environment or yung closed room na wala masyadong air from the outside. Now that we have the AP201 open, you can also appreciate the PSU shroud. Di kagaya ng ibang cases, usually nandito sa rear yung PSU. Itong AP201, nandito yung PSU sa harap. So what that allows ASUS to do is na yung shroud, imbis na dito horizontally, ngayon dito na siya vertically sa harap. So you get a lot more view of the components that you do want to see. Your GPU, RGB fans dito sa ilalim, AIO sa taas. And usually, wala ka naman pake what your PSU looks like. So tinago nila dito sa harap. And you really have to appreciate the build quality of ASUS. This thing is so sturdy. I mean, when you knock it, the metal sounds so solid. There are nice little touches na it reminds you na, yes, I'm a quality product. Kagaya lang nung pangalan niya dito, etched on the side. You'll also notice na naka-etch din siya dito the customer-facing side panel here. So everything so quality about this build as we've come to expect <laughs> from an ASUS product. Also, just wanted to appreciate the work of the guys done with the sh in the shop. Yung tumitingin lang dito sa side na to, yung mga builders and enthusiasts lang talaga. 
Pero pinaghirapan din talaga namin yung cable management. So props to the guys in the shop. There's a lot of room for cable management here. Very roomy. Especially compared to other MATX cases. Yun nga, since they were able to extend the case forward, it's longer than most. There's a lot more room, specifically in this cavity and this cavity, to route the cables for proper cable management as we've done here. And the top. So overall, a very nice looking case from ASUS. It ticks the boxes for both performance and aesthetics. We give it 4.5 out of 5 candies. I, very difficult to find anything quite wrong with this case. The price might be a little high. That's a premium price that you usually expect with ASUS. And to be fair, you're getting what you pay for. Sobrang quality nito. To be honest, uh, the guys at the shop are hopeful na, na makalimutan na ni ASUS na pinahiram nila to sa amin. So sa amin na lang to. Baka makita mo siya sa shop one day. But it's a very beautiful case. Bagay rin siya both for office and for work. It is a performance case with its mesh, but it also looks good. But the aesthetic is muted enough that you can use it for work. Or you can also have it as a gaming PC in your home. So it straddles that line between being professional looking at the same time na kung enthusiast ka, maeenganyo ka pa rin to use it in a gaming rig. Itong form factor na medyo closer to the ground, kind of longer so it can fit in all of the large components. Bagay siya to the current meta ng pagka PC building. Na medyo palaki ng palaki ng graphics cards. You do want a large AIO para makul yung CPU. This checks all of the boxes. To be honest, kawawa yung ibang MATX cases namin. I can't, I can't look at them the same way anymore after having experienced itong AP201. Paminsan, may nagtatanong kung may kilala ba kaming computer shop na trusted yung hindi ka lolokohin. Actually, meron. Kami. Full service PC store ang Hardware Sugar. Nagbabenta kami ng PC components. Nagbabenta rin kami ng fully assembled rigs. We clean computers. Kasama na rin yung excellent cable management namin and CPU cooler repasting sa cleaning. We also clean and repaste GPUs. Nasa Makati yung physical store namin and you can also buy from our site www.hwsugar.ph na 100% palaging up-to-date yung inventory dun. Kung in-stock yung item sa amin, available yun sa site. We also ship nationwide. Thanks for watching and maybe one of these days, magkita tayo sa shop.